put my makeup and my skincare, all of that in like travel baggies, and that way like nothing breaks. This area needs the most work. I have these two plastic bins through and see what I want to keep. Hello guys, it's my first time talking to you guys from my new place. It feels so weird but also so exciting to finally share this chapter of my life with you guys to bring you guys in in my new home. You guys remember I started off in my mom's house in that tiny little bedroom then I moved into the master bedroom and then from there I outgrew that space and I finally got a place of my own and I'm so excited. This search was not easy by the way. I looked through almost all the apartments here in Houston, at least in like the city area. This place really felt like home. It's a really large, spacious area, which is exactly what I wanted. I know definitely in a year I'm gonna outgrow this place. My lease is only for a year and then inshallah, we'll have a home or something in the future. We'll see where I end up, but I'm so excited to take you guys along with me and to show you this place, I absolutely love it and I think you guys are going to love it too. You guys are invited in so let's go ahead and get started. So I'm at the door. When I flip the camera around this is the hallway entry you walk into and I like the idea of like having a big table here and setting up the console and stuff like that. This hallway is like absolutely huge. I don't think the camera is actually picking it up but yes we do have boxes in the hallway. I'm just filming this empty apartment tour. I'm um, just pretty late. But yeah, so you walk in up to the right, you have a huge pantry. I'm not gonna open it up. It is packed with stuff in there. Like that is the trashiest part of the apartment. We enter in the kitchen and living room space, which is what I fell in love with when I toured this place. It's so stunning. I have never stayed in a place that is like a high rise. I have um, 12 inch ceilings and floor to ceiling windows. I feel like it really does bring in so much light into the space and it's just so different and I love it. I also really love the flooring. It's a really pretty light brown. Like I just could not have asked for a better space. Also actually get the sunset, which is just absolutely stunning. The whole area turns like orange around golden hour and it's just so nice. I'm gonna try to take you outside, but it is so loud. So just bear with me. So that wraps around to the second bedroom. This is the view. It is, it is pretty loud. But yeah, our balcony is massive. So this wraps all the way around to my bedroom, which I will show you in the bathroom. So yeah, I really love the space. It's so nice. And then facing forward is our kitchen, which I am so excited to start making cooking videos with you guys and just sharing some recipes, meal planning, and all of that. So this is the kitchen. Again, love the colors. I love that it's like white and um, this really pretty brown color. Uh, I'm not totally in love with the backsplash, if I'm being completely honest, but like, who cares? It's not my place. I mean, I can deal with this. Like, everything else in the apartment I absolutely love. There's the microwave, and then here is the sink. And then from the kitchen, this is the view. That blind right there is stuck, I need to fix it. I forgot to show you guys the coolest part. I'm so excited about this. I've already stocked up on some of my favorite drinks, but I have a wine cellar, like what? So when I have guests over, I can offer drinks and stuff, Olipops and poppies, and it's going to be so nice when I have guests over, so I really love that. Also that lighting right there um, is supposed to be the dining room area, which we're getting that taken out, and I'm gonna be putting my own chandelier because I am extra. So this entire space is either going to be my studio or I'm actually going to put a dining table. I'm not sure yet. Only because the space is so big and I got four bar stools, so I feel like I can sit there and like eat and I'll be totally fine. Um, so yeah, this perhaps will be like a nook. If I turn around, this is the view. And okay, so going forward, that is where we are going to put the TV. And I didn't mention, this is a 1800 or 1900 square foot apartment. Um, a TV will go there and then the couch will probably end there. And then we still have this entire space in the back to play around with. The model home had like a lounging chair in the back and I thought that was like super cute. It could be like a little nook in the back. Yeah, that is this space, probably my favorite space 
in the apartment and then going down the right hand side is the um, master room again a beautiful view um, the only thing that I actually got gypped on was the closet space I mean it's okay but it's like not massive if you guys have any ideas of how to best utilize the space also the cool thing is we're having California closets come and customize this closet and do a full complete completely new build out so I'll see how this area transforms but until then if you have any um, ideas on how to best organize this place and how to best utilize it like should I put bins here um, and do one for hijab and undergarments and stuff like that please let me know right now I'm just kind of living out of this box honestly and it works it's like my pajamas and stuff like that and then on a daily basis I truthfully just wear sweatshirts so all of those are like stacked up there and yeah these are just a few things because I have been going to parties and stuff from my apartment so I've been getting ready um, I wore that blazer out one night and like I wear that abaya to um, a Quran class that happens every Tuesday and just like different stuff but yeah and then the bathroom you guys is something else that I love there was another selling point for me um, I feel like I can make so many beautiful get ready with me videos here like how stunning is that? What? And again, a view, so nice. And you don't have to worry about privacy because I literally am on the top floor. So you can't see me in a high rise building. So you can imagine there's 25 floors, but also there are blinds. And then you turn this way and a beautiful vanity. And then the other thing that I freaking love is the shower. It is massive. I love how big the shower is. Love that there's a little bench there. There's a little shelving. Also so much cabinet space, which I love. So that we have those, these drawers here and this. So right, I have the secondary room and a washer dryer closet, which is so nice. It's spacious as well. It's a huge closet. I actually have some laundry that I need to get going right after I'm done filming this video. So that is that. And then we have our first uh, bathroom, which is also the guest bathroom. And when I turn on the light, I love the bathrooms. They're just very like, modern. Um, the showers are great. It's just so nice. This is the secondary room. I'm not really sure what to do with this space. It could possibly become my studio or whatnot, but it's a nice large space. I don't think the camera is doing it any justice or picking up how big it is, but it's really nice. It also has this um, floor to ceiling window, which brings in a ton of light in the afternoon. Um, so yeah, it just is really nice to be filming in here. There's also a balcony that wraps around. Um, so I really like that. It meets in the living room. So great little area to just lounge around. And yeah, it's a really big space. Um, I do have a closet there as well, which I just closed off, but it looks exactly like the primary room's closet. So that is pretty much it. And then go back into the hallway. So that is pretty much it. This was the entirety of my apartment tour. A ton of great content to come. I've started moving things in, but I have like proper videos showing you guys things that I'm organizing, um, new gadgets I'm getting, furniture shopping. Oh my God, you guys. It has been a struggle trying to find like a proper couch for this place because I don't want to spend it too much since it is a rental but also I have an aesthetic and I want it to look a certain way so it has been a nightmare trying to find a couch but yeah that will be a separate video and I'm just so excited there's so many great things to come inshallah so I hope you guys are excited with me leave your best tips down below for moving how to adjust to a new place like things like must home must-haves that you think I have to have because I'm new I don't know how to do this my mom has been coming over and bringing like little things that I didn't even think about like a dustpan and like the little brush, I'm like, oh yeah, I do need that. And like, there's so many little, little things and I just, 
I feel so new to this space. See you guys in my next video where hopefully we will be furnishing. Oh, I do have those two boxes that you guys saw in the hallway. Those are actually my bar stool. I will be doing an unboxing. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I love you guys so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video, which will be furnishing. Bye.